very surprised because I genuinely only asked for two things. Hey guys, Madison here. Hey guys, Madison here. Welcome to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, even though I'm gonna like click bake the heck out of it and like vlogmas Christmas day, um, even though I've not been doing vlogmas, um, this is like a vlogish video. It's on Christmas. Um, this is my normal like upload day anyway, so I thought why not like just make it Christmas related. I could like show you guys things I got for Christmas. Um, and I'm very surprised because I genuinely only asked for two things. Um, it's just a weird vlog for today. Um, so yeah, uh, we'll just start into this. It's a very weird when I think about video. Um, but I'll start it off with, I did only ask my parents for two things. I was like, you know, I'm on the rowing team at my school. I go through sneakers so fast. Like I, I ruin sneakers. I genuinely do. And so I was like, if you could just get me, just go to Walmart, buy the little $5, like all black, like shoe or all white tennis shoes type things. I was like, just a bunch of those. I will be forever thankful because we're only gonna have three free weekends this year if it works out the way we're wanting to. Like we're gonna be constantly doing stuff this year. Um, and I'm gonna go through so many pairs of shoes, I already know. And I have been doing workouts this entire like Christmas break that we have off. And I've been having to do them because I don't have sneakers. I'm having to do them in these. These are like little boat shoes. I've had these for five years. And like, <laughs> These shoes are indestructible. <laughs> um, but yeah, I've had these for so long and I just, I don't have any tennis shoes right now. So I was like, I really need tennis shoes. Again, I have my heater on. So if you hear that roaring, that's what that is. Um, but I was like, yeah, just a bunch of shoes. That's all I need to get me through the entire semester. And then I was like, also, because my roommate, who I love, I love my roommate. Um, she has this little single cup Keurig thing that was really cheap. She said she got it for less than $100 um, at Walmart during like their Christmas event. And it just does like one little cup of coffee. And <laughs> I was like, I really want one of those. They're really cheap. And that can be like my Christmas. That's all I want. And <laughs> I just want to talk about it. And my roommate even left her Keurig here for me. She's like, you know, if you want to use it over the break, feel free. And I was like, thank you. And I was like, also thank you because you've inspired me to actually ask for something for Christmas. I was like, I've, my mom's just had to wing it my entire life because I've just never known what I wanted. And so I was like, I wasn't even, I was the kid that I never really made a list either. I was just like, anything, generally anything. I don't care. Um, so we're going to, I still can't believe what my mom got me. Um, so we're just gonna dive in. So I'm working and I'm working tonight as well, but I worked last night. And so right after work, I go straight home. I just go to bed and I wake up, I go to the tree. There's a few things there. So I was like, okay, this is cool. So sneakers, and I wanna talk about these. I don't care about brands or anything like that, but look at the shoe, oh my gosh. Ah! And then this side, it has like glitter on it. I feel like this is what you'd get a child and I am so ecstatic. And then like the tongue is velvet and it feels like velvet on the inside as well. I am so ready to break these shoes. <laughs> like these are so cool. And I love how like bright this is. So yeah, this was the first thing and it was only one pair of shoes. And I already know I'm gonna have to like go to Walmart, buy their little $5 shoes and just wreck them because I just go through tennis shoes so fast. It's not even funny, but like these are so dope. I love the glitter. Um, so from this, I know my mother knows me well and that I am a child. Um, I'm just playing with the glitter on this side. It just squishes around. Um, so there's this, we love this. Um, and then there's this and I'll explain it because my hair looks like garbage right now. I did just get home and you know, it is what it is. It does that weird little wave moment. So my hair normally looks like this. I'll insert it when it's really, really curly. Um, so it is, in fact, very curly. Unless I kind of like brush it through or just pull it back and let it dry like that. It just goes whichever way it feels like it. <laughs> my mom got me a diffuser and I'm so excited to use this because um, 
I don't really have a good hair dryer. I have a very tiny mini hair dryer and that's what I'll use to kind of like dry down my roots because my hair is so thick that it takes like two hours to dry almost. And so if I want to do my hair curly and actually like scrunch my curls and like dry them like that, again, I've never had a diffuser. So my little heater that I have down here is what I've been using to scrunch and do my hair. So <laughs> realizing how that sounds is really bad. Like I have been using a floor heater to curl my hair. We've had some good times, but I'm excited to uh, let this heater go uh, to the floor and let it stay there um, because I finally have just a decent hair dryer and I'm so thankful for my mom for listening to me whenever um, I had told her what I was doing. <laughs> and I'm just thinking, my mom heard me say, I've been, I'll just use my heater. Me not thinking anything of it. And my mom just thought that is the saddest thing that you could ever do. <laughs> and that's why she got me the hair dryer. The other thing before I get to the uh, Keurig thing, um, the other thing that my mom got me that was kind of like the little stop and sucker. So <laughs> I said stop and sucker stocking stuffer let's speak correctly um and it's it's making me think that my mom i don't know if she was just so excited that i actually said something i wanted that she just listened to me all year because i i got crabby patties i got some bags of them so i told her i was like i can never find these anymore like i know they're at walmart but they go so fast and i can never just find the original crabby patty because they are so good compared to the uh, little, I guess, do they do a Christmas one that's like a Christmas tree shape? These are better. These are superior and she found these and <laughs> I was so excited to get those this morning. I'm gonna have those demolished. Diet who, working out who. Um, and then, is this the right bag? Um, I don't think it is. Okay, also, watermelon sour patches or a superior sour patch uh so that's like candy i love candy but i like gummy candy very specifically i'm not a big chocolate eater but i will tear up some gummies um these were just so pajamas she got me a few like little closey things but like look at it it's a cat ah! and then the pants match so got some pajamas uh this shirt was actually something she got me uh my mom has never like tie-dye stuff she's like it's so so it's so trendy and I was like okay I don't hate it I also got these little jeans that I'm wearing they're like high-waisted that go up to my tongue and it's hard to find high-waisted stuff um there's another shirt like this if I can find it I'll show it um but I need to get that bag I think I got the wrong bag I I wish I had my mother's like buying skills and stuff because I know all of this was like on sale somehow because my mom doesn't spend a whole lot <laughs> so um I found the last bag that she gave me the other bag was from a family friend i might just showcase that because it's kind of funny just what happened um i also got some little pajamas like as soon as i got home she shoved them in my face i was like i got his matching pajamas i did take a picture of them they're right here um but yeah so there's that i cannot find this other shirt and i've just moved everything in and it's gonna take a while for me to actually find things right now um so that's just, it's fine. It's just a little white version of this that I think has like blue little spots. Um, but yeah, tie dye for some reason. My mom hates it and likes this one. <laughs> I was very confused. Um, I don't mind tie dye. I'm thankful for getting anything. Um, so, uh, like I said, I told her that I liked something. Coffee. I told her that I liked coffee. One thing of coffee. Two things of coffee. Three things of coffee. <laughs> and they're like big things. I was like, mom, was this expensive? She's like, no, don't worry about it. I was like, this, this is interesting. But yeah, there's, there's a lot. Of, and also, cause I was like, you know, I've really just been using like the great value K cup things that are like the caramel. And I was like, I, I really like caramel. So I have a cream brulee, which sounds amazing. And I might try that. Oh, but then there's the butterscotch caramel and then caramel drizzle. <laughs> Sounds like a stripper name. <laughs> anyway, what's left in the bag is like 
a cute little necklace. Again, I'm sure it was like cheap, which I am okay with because I love little cheap necklaces. I think they're the prettiest. It's just a little ball necklace, which kind of looks like a silver bell to me and I'm getting like Polar Express vibes. So there was that and it's not wanting to go back in the box. Go back in the box, okay. Um, ugh. makeup wipes, lashes, and some uh, kind of like knockoff prism colors, is that what it is? Oh, Copic, Copic, that's what it is. Um, so it's some of those and I'm excited to use these because I've been wanting some of these so bad. Maybe not this brand, but I think if you've ever tried like the knockoff Copic colors, they're not that bad. They're actually kind of good. And you know, I'm excited to see how good these are. So that's gonna be a fun little moment. Um, and yeah, that was it for this bag. So I'm gonna like stack some stuff back in, but remember the coffee. The coffee is what is important. I told my mom for the first time that I really enjoy something. So she gave me another bag and she's like, this is from a family friend of ours. And I guess she told them that she was getting me the Keurig and she's like, oh, she just loves coffee now. Um, I've always liked coffee. I just want to put that out there. I just didn't really have a way to make it. We only have so much like school allotted free money that we get each semester. It's really weird. Um, and we can use that towards Starbucks. And I don't feel like walking to Starbucks. Sometimes I don't feel like driving to Starbucks. So I can only get so much coffee, but <laughs> We got some coffee, some coffee, and, and some hot cocoa, which is the gateway drug to coffee. I'm just letting y'all know, if y'all give y'all's child a bunch of hot cocoa, they are gonna be coffee drinkers. Just letting you know. Um, but I want to talk about this bougie box. I've never heard of this before, but it is a two-step hot cocoa coffee oh mocha latte so yeah it's coffee this is two steps <laughs> i've never heard of two-step coffee but i'm excited i don't know if in the other bag it's like that chocolate fillings or whatever but i really want to make this and that might be something i do right now once i get my stuff set up so i have at this point i have more coffee than food <laughs> Four, five, six. I have six things of coffee. Not to mention the little K cups, great value brand that I got at the beginning of this break. Cause I was like, okay, every now and then I just might want some coffee. And I was like, my mom's gonna get me a cure egg machine so I can just use them then. <laughs> I have so much coffee. <laughs> and I just think it's so funny. But um, also this friend of the family got me a mug. And this is kind of cool. I love this. I don't use these a whole lot. I have little mugs, you know, I have, what is that? There's paper in there. Um, but it's like, it's cold up to nine hours, hot up to three hours. That's cool, that's dope. And I like the little weird paint pour type wrapping that's on it. Um, but yeah, so this was something. <laughs> um, and then a candle that my mother told me not to light in my dorm because I will burn it down. Little does she know I have like three candles. Not lit right now, but I have candles. Um, so yeah, now let's get to the cure. <laughs> this box is bigger than me. What is this? <laughs> okay, so, and the thing is from the front, this looks like my roommate's coffee thing. And I was like, mom, this is huge. And so I take it off, I take it off. Um, I'll take it out, a, a little, I'll showcase it. It's my first like, little coffee maker, so I think it's kind of dope. Um, take off the little wrappings. This thing's huge. Look at this. This is not what my roommate has. She has just a little tiny thin one that's one cup. This is like, you make three cups out of it. I'm gonna have coffee for days, my dude. So whatever I'm doing all nighters because I'm taking like 18 hours a semester for some reason and one of them's French and I don't even know how I'm gonna do in that class. I will always have coffee to keep me company. <laughs> I'm very happy with this. This is all I wanted in life and I just hit myself in the face with it twice. 
and I think that was generally it and <laughs> I'm so ecstatic. <laughs> so it wasn't like a big haul or anything. I am generally happy with the things that I want, you know, quality over quantity. If it's something you're actually excited for, you will enjoy it no matter what. Ah! <laughs> I'm gonna break it, I'm gonna stop. Um, but yeah, this is kind of just how my Christmas is going. I have to work at 5.30, um, serving hot chocolate, because that's personality as well, um, along with liking coffee, apparently. My entire pantry, like my side of our pantry, is gonna be filled with coffee now. But I'm ready for it, I'm excited. I wanna make a cup of coffee. I wanna make this specific coffee. Um, just to show it, I guess, I don't know. Um, so I'm gonna do that real quick, get it set up, get it somewhere. I have no idea where I'm gonna put this. As you can see, I've cleared off my uh, decorations that were back here um, because I did it for a final. I'm done with the class, I'm done with Christmas. So I was like, all of my stuff that I've piled over in this corner has to go back up on that wall. And I don't know if I have enough time in the day to do that. Ugh. Cause I'm like, it's 2.47 now. If I do all this, will I have enough time to like get to work at 5.30 and like look somewhat decent cause I look like garbage right now. So, oh, I came with instructions. But yes, this was my Christmas. I'm gonna make some m mocha latte made from real milk. Well, it's gonna have some real water. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna set this up and we'll figure it out as we go. Oh my gosh, it's making noise. I didn't click a button. There's nothing in there. I swear to God, the search dropped what I was gonna say. I had a little coffee, or not coffee, um, cauldron mug that I was gonna use it. And we were gonna see what happens. So I wanna make something. Um, it's two parts froth packet and the mocha latte. Which one goes in first? Let's see. Um, okay, so I put the milk packet into the mug and then put in K-cup. Okay, so let's do this. We are, I'm so scared that water's gonna stir it. There's nothing there. I have to use some handy dandy scissors. Okay. Just gonna pour our froth packet in there. That's like half the cup. It's a very tiny little cup there. So, I'm gonna put in a tiny cup. Let's hope for the best. If it starts like going crazy, I don't know what to do. Hasn't started yet. I should probably get a second cup. I have a second cup, I have a straw to mix. I pressed the button because it was like blinking again, even though I pressed it once. And we will wait. Very like, it's very interesting. Like this is some bougie chocolate. I'm excited. Maybe you can keep me going through. Uh, I don't want to drink too much coffee because I do that sometimes. And I was about to say, I hope it gets me going through like work, but then what if it keeps me up on? Because <laughs> I already like don't sleep whenever I'm here. I don't have anything to do, like, I'm trying to make myself sleep, but it's hard. That sounds like my heater. You okay, baby? Are we Gucci? <laughs> I'm, like, so scared. And because my mom was, like, so proud of it, she's like, it's $60. It's not pouring yet. But yeah, this was 60 bucks. My mom told me, she was like, Okay. I did put the tiny cup, so I hope it does like go for the tiny cup. It is filling up my cup. This is a very tiny little cauldron mug. I mostly use it for hot chocolate. So I'm having to... Okay. Oh, that would have made it. I kind of stopped it from pouring because I was scared I was going to uh, fill it up too much. So the tiny cup size is perfect for my little cauldron mug. I didn't know that. It like does perfect. So now I'm stirring in all this stuff. Oh, it's getting all good and frothy. This is cool. You're not going again, are you? <laughs> Sounds like it is for some reason. This is 
turn it off. Um, but yeah, so I took it, it has three settings. That didn't make sense. It smells good. So it has three settings. One is like a big old mug, one's like a medium mug, and then this was like the little teacup almost. And so I'm trying to get all of this stuff to melt. This is so cool. Look at all that froth. Oh, that tastes really good. Um, but yeah, so it has like three different little sizes. This is so cool. I'm so excited. This is like a generally one of the few things that I've asked for that I've really wanted in a long time. And so <laughs> the fact that it's just so much bigger um, just makes it like 10 times more amazing. It's got all these different little bells and whistles now. And I got so many different little chocolates. Okay, so it's probably still like burning hot. Yes, but it's not bad. It has that uh, bitter coffee taste. If I was to do a review of this, it has like, maybe not even like bitter coffee, almost like bitter chocolate, you know? It's a little bit bitter, but it tastes like a mocha. And it's pretty good. It's not that bad. And that's the little milk thing. I really like the froth. I've never really seen anything that had like a froth packet with it. So I think that was really cool. But other than that, this has been a Christmas haul or Santa came vlogmas, whatever I'm gonna title this as. Just me making coffee is basically what it was before work. Just a little fun Christmas moment before I have to go to work. So I hope y'all's Christmases have been good. Oh my goodness, that's so good. Um, I hope y'all have had a fun time with y'all's family because that's important too, not just like stuff that you get is spending time with your family, especially during this time when a lot of people can't or it's their first Christmas without certain people in their family. It's a difficult time for a lot of people and I'm just making this video as a distraction or just something for people to watch, you know, just something out there into the universe. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you made it this far into the video, uh, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe. If you're not, turn on the bell so you can be notified when I upload. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for making it through this long of the video of me just doing absolutely nothing and crying and laughing. Um, but yeah, all my social media is linked down below. I love connecting with you guys on all different forms of social media and I upload every Wednesday and Friday, but for like this week and then Maybe next week there might be a few more extra uploads, just me trying to get content out that I wanted to make before 2021. Um, and we'll see how that goes. <laughs> There's a few things I wanted to do. I don't know. I hope that I can get them out before 2021. Um, right now I'm pumping through different videos that I'm trying to make because I have sponsorships. I have uh, reviews of certain makeup and just products in general. And I have makeup looks that I want to do. And I might do a tasting different K-Cups or Keurig Cups coffee video just because I want to give myself a heart attack at 21. But we'll see what happens. As always, thank you for watching and I will see you all next time. Bye.